Let's get it. Trusted Kicks Dallas. It's coming soon. We really gonna merge with the biggest vintage store in Dallas. All right, when I say merge, what's gonna happen? We gonna come in like the bosses we are. We've been working with the owner over there. I'm not gonna say the name of the store because the paperwork, the ink ain't dry yet on the paperwork, you know, but we're gonna work out basically buying the store. When we say buy it, they're gonna keep the vintage merch in there and we'll work for them to sell the merch, vintage merch, but all the fixtures, all the cool setup and all the cool, um, let's say memorabilia, we're gonna buy all that or keep that on the wall basically, all right? That will happen August 1st. What'll happen before then? We'll come down to the Dallas location. Yeah, that's cool, let's do it, let's do it. That's what they wanna see. We'll come down <laughs> to the Dallas location and we're gonna piss some people off. When I say piss some people off, I mean we're gonna run that like a normal trusted buy, sell, and trade for four months only. Four months only, buy, sell, and trade, meaning bring your shoes down, we're gonna buy them, sell them to them, and we're gonna do trades. We'll have shoes on the wall, like how we used to do it in Milwaukee and Houston, all right? Come at the top of the year, shut it down. Club members only. You guys know about that. I won't confuse you guys. But in Dallas, it's going to be crazy. Shout out to the Cowboys. Shout out to the Dallas Rangers, the Texas Rangers. But you know they based out of Dallas, the Dallas Stars. We're going to be there. If you got shoes in Dallas, we will be starting to buy in Dallas somewhere around late July. We'll have weekends at the store location. We'll make a flyer, drop the Instagram, drop the address, pull up. We'll be buying. Grand opening. Sometime early August, you know how we do. $5 steals, $4 steals, $10 shoes, $100 shoes. It's going to be crazy. Until then, I want y'all to comment below and let me know, have y'all ever heard of a sneaker store and a vintage store merging into one? I never heard of it. I really didn't know how to execute the business side of it. I know that the owner of that store is my boy, and I actually went to Dallas to talk to him about finding the store, and this when he kind of pitched the idea. So I think it's going to work for us because we get a store with foot traffic already and he's, we're gonna take over his smaller Instagram and then also it's gonna work for him because he gets to leave the store but still sell all his merch and I don't want that much of a fee if I take any fee on the top. What I really wanna do is have his store, his stuff be the vintage and we come in and take over the hype. Other than that, it's Trust Rico signing out. If you ain't in the club, you ain't getting plugged, shout out to all the homies in Discord, all right? Everybody who watching this group, the first person to DM me on Discord, I'm sending you a $100 gift card. Let's get it. All right.